again. Hey everyone, welcome back to JSA TV. This is our last live broadcast here from uh, the ESG Summit here in Oslo um, this week. Uh, we are so thankful to Data Cloud for putting on another amazing event. As you know, we love Data Cloud events. We, we uh, were just at Data, Data Cloud USA a couple of weeks ago in Austin, Texas. Um, we love Data Cloud Monaco, and, and now we're very excited to come to our first Data Cloud ESG Summit. So uh, thanks for having us. Thanks to, to everyone. Um, who participated in this awesome conference this week? We would we thought that we'd wrap up the uh, the week um, and our live coverage here by getting into the the numbers a little bit. So we'll do a quick by the numbers. Absolutely, and I hope that we got the numbers right. We're looking <laughs> at them. We did our best. This is uh, you know maybe our math that we did here, but I think we've got it mostly down. We've definitely had two full days of networking panels and fireside chats all around sustainability and ESG, and in total, um, that's twenty five events that speakers took part in over that two day period. All right. And we've also 50 uh, speakers, probably more than 50 speakers at those 25 events. And uh, of course, additional time spent um, during coffee breaks and, and two evening networking events um, that were kind of the official ones. Um, there was also some other things going on um, throughout the city this week and uh, hundreds of attendees who gathered in Oslo for this um, inaugural ESG Summit event. We had more than 20 JSA TV interviews um, over the past two days. Uh, so thanks for everyone for stopping by. Several of those interviews were kind of, you know, on on the fly. Um, hopefully you couldn't tell that, but, you know, uh, people kind of walking up and, and seeing the setup and wanting to jump in. So um, we really we really saw a lot of uh, interest and love um, and demand here at the event this week. So thank you to everyone there. I can't believe we did that many, and I can't believe Candace Sipos took <laughs> about eight of those alone today. It was amazing to watch. Hope you guys watch them back. Um, and finally, you've got two JSAers here who traveled to five different locations um, to be in Oslo this week. We're so glad we did. We had so much fun here, um, and we cannot wait to come back and see how all of the plans that we've heard about this week are coming to fruition here in Norway. And I also want to add four or five, six, seven other JSAers yes. back home. Um, shout out to uh, Nikki and Blarum who are watching this right now, helping us on the back end of the live stream. And also to Mary, um, who is amazing and, and did the same thing yesterday. Um, Natalie, who Buffy. helped us with a bunch of social. Buffy, who's always helping with uh, events and partnerships. Allison, uh, doing all the logistics. So, you know, there's two faces on the screen, but there's about 10 people supporting us behind the scenes that you don't see. So uh, thanks to everyone one there. Um, and uh, yeah, I think that about wraps it up. Is there exactly. anything else? Anything else you got for Oslo there? No, Emily? I think that's it. This All is right. us signing off, catching signing flights, off. and we'll see you soon. All right. Happy networking.